All right, lads, so in this video, I'm going to be discussing five things that we don't want to see in Soccer Manager 2022. But before we jump straight into the video, make sure you smash a like on this video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. That would be highly appreciated. But yeah, let's get straight into the video. I just want to say thank you for 3,000 subscribers, guys. Like, it's an insane achievement, and I couldn't have done it without you guys. And I just want to thank every single one of you that have subscribed to my channel and have supported me. And I mean, yeah, so I've decided to do a giveaway um, and everyone has a chance of winning some money all you have to do to enter is make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn the notification bell on it's as simple as that and in two weeks from now I'll be announcing the two winners and um, I'll also be contacting the two winners for more details but yeah good luck so the first thing that we don't want to see in soccer manager 2022 is unrealistic coding and we've seen some pretty unrealistic coding in the previous soccer manager games in terms of the amount of goals scored and the results I mean we've seen some of the weakest teams beating some of the best teams in the game on a regular basis which just isn't realistic because 99 times out of 100 the best team will be beating the weaker team and also the amount of goals scored I mean You'll find the opposition scoring six goals, you scoring six goals, and you don't even know who the opposition is. And besides, like sometimes you'll score three goals and it's coded so that the opposition has to score one goal. I mean, it just isn't realistic. So hopefully we can see some better coding in terms of the amount of goals scored and the results in Soccer Manager 2022. Moving on to the second thing that we don't want to see in Soccer Manager 2022, and that is old stadium designs. Now we've pretty much been seeing the same stadium designs year after year, and it's getting a little boring now. So I think it would be nice to introduce some new stadium designs and styles to Soccer Manager 2022. Two. Let me just use this as an example. So we've got the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium in Soccer Manager 2021, and we've got the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium in real life, and they look nothing alike. So I think introducing some new stadium designs and styles to Soccer Manager 2022 definitely would give the stadiums that realistic factor. Moving on to the third thing that we don't want to see in Soccer Manager 2022, and that is the same trophy celebration. Now, every time your team won a trophy, they celebrate, right? But they celebrate the same way every time they won a trophy. So if you've just won the FA Cup, your team's gonna celebrate like they've just won the Champions League and it gets a little boring. So introducing some new trophy celebrations definitely would make it more interesting. And people don't really care about their team winning a trophy, they skip it anyway. So introducing different trophy celebrations would get people to watch their team lift a trophy. And it will also make the experience a whole lot better. Moving on to the fourth thing that we don't want to see in Soccer Manager 2022, and that is the same old glitches. Now we've seen some bugs in the game for years years. These bugs include the unlimited timer glitch where the timer just doesn't stop until you restart the game or one that we've recently seen in Soccer Manager 2021 where a player's career will reset and they pretty much just become a youth player again which didn't really make sense to me and hopefully they fix these bugs in Soccer Manager 2022 because they just don't make the game fun at all. Moving on to the last thing that we don't want to see in Soccer Manager 2022 and that is no fan celebrations. Every time your team score you will see that the players are celebrating but you won't see the fans celebrating. You can hear them but you can't see them and I think it's time that they add a feature that shows footage of the fans celebrating just to get them involved more and just to make it more realistic because it just doesn't feel right not seeing the fans celebrate every time you score a goal so it's time to get the fans involved but yeah those are five things that we don't want to see in soccer manager 2022 let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below but yeah i will see you in the next video